All right, Todd's here with a closer look at the forecast, and today not so good. Mm -hmm. Wednesday sounds really wet. Yeah, I mean, for you know, the most part, early this part of the week is not going to be terrible. I mean, there are some stray showers in the forecast. It's really not till Wednesday that we we get into the crummy stuff where it's just kind of washout material. But until then, it's going to be fine, especially northern Maine. I mean, once again today, it's going to be bright and beautiful. Uh, it's going to be a lot like last week where, you know, the south is in the clouds, the north is in the sunshine, and that's where we're at this morning. We've got a front draped to the south of us right now. So beneath the clouds, it's actually fairly mild this morning. Portland's 52, Lewiston's 51. As you get into the clear air and warmth from yesterday escaped into outer space, it's colder. Bangor's 42, and check out the numbers from Arista County. A lot of towns right around the frosty 32 degree mark. There's the front draped over southern New England. There are some showers up here near the Great Lakes in southern Canada, but a lot of this is going to dry up as it moves into New England. The air's bone dry right now, so outside of a stray sprinkle or shower, that's about all we see for now for now. And then that low is the one that moves in on Wednesday, and that's what gives us, you know, the drenching. Cloudy but mild south, bright but chilly to the north. There's your morning. No commuting issues, so that's some good news. Middle of the day, really no change. Once again, that split state thing where the clouds are over southern Maine and the sun shines over eastern and northern Maine. And we'll have seasonable temperatures, 50s to around 60. Afternoon and evening, mostly cloudy skies. There might be a light shower or sprinkle, but not enough, as I mentioned earlier, to cancel any plans, whether it's your kids' plans or your plans. They'll be fine. And it'll remain quiet and tranquil right up through dusk and dark. So you're fine this evening once you get home from work. Here's a look at the high temps beneath the clouds. It's a little cooler, especially near the coastline where winds eventually turn on shore. But for a while, they're going to be very, very light. 57 for Portland, a little milder in Lewiston, 59, 60 for Rangeley. Warm spot in the state is right in here. Once again this week, Bangor hitting 62, Millinock at 62 and Callis 61. So if you want to see the sun and the warmer temps, you got to go to the north and east today. Later tonight and tomorrow, the first of two waves will be sliding by. This one goes pretty far to the south. That's why I don't think I'm not really too positive on rainfall here. I don't think we're going to get much out of it. Yes, southern Maine will have some scattered showers around, but northern Maine will not. So it's really Wednesday when we all get on the act with this storm system working in. It'll be stronger, takes a more northerly route and offers up drops for the entire state and all of New Hampshire too, by the way. And I'm actually optimistic on this rainfall. Again, March was so dry, most of April was too. So now that we're getting into these rainfall amounts, this is pretty good stuff, up around an inch out of this guy. That would be two weeks in a row that we're getting a sizable rain event. And that's perfect news as we enter the drier season, you know, the summer months when it's warmer and we typically only get thunderstorms for rainfall. And that's hit or miss, right? Marine forecast sees two to three feet, wind light, super quiet on the water today. Partly sunny skies with highs around 60. Tomorrow it's mostly cloudy. And again, a shower is possible in the morning, especially over southern Maine. It'll be cooler tomorrow with highs in the 50s. And then we've got cold rain on Wednesday. That's the day that's you know not too pleasing. Outside activities, practices, games, your thing will be likely uh, kind of in limbo there. Maybe have to be canceled or postponed. Thursday clearing out much better, 62. There's a small chance for a storm Friday into Saturday. May offer up a little bit more rain, but chances there aren't that high at this moment. I do like the way Sunday looks, and hey, um, that's kind of a big day around here and across the country. <laughs> it's Mother's Day. It so better that's be. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> right. Sunday fun day. All right. Mm. Thank you, sir. Yep.